Essentially, neuroplasticity is change, is change in uh, the behavior of neurons. And a lot of how neurons process information is based on what connections they make with other neurons. So two neurons come together and talk to each other and they sort of exchange chemicals. And that is now a circuit, a bit of information in the brain. We used to think that all of the brain cells you had, you know, you were limited by the time you were done with childhood. Now we know you're still producing new brain cells your entire life although at a smaller rate compared to where you were as a child. More importantly, the number of cells is the connections between cells. We actually have a huge amount of cells in our brain, and theoretically the amount of connections they can make between cells is a vast, vast amount of information. More information than there probably are bits of information in the world. You'll never run out of storage capacity in your brain. Getting access to things you've stored, recalling memories, choosing what you're going to think about, that's where the trick of brain sort of performance comes in. Uh, but neuroplasticity essentially is the changeability of the brain, its ability to react and learn. And we have that our entire lives. One of the things we're trying to do is enhance that neuroplasticity uh, through things like biofeedback and meditation, nootropics, good sleep and good nutrition.